Hello and welcome to PA Academy. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to draw a circle uh, to touch three given lines. So if we have three, three lines, let's say something like this. This is the first line, second line, and then the third line. So how can we draw a circle that will touch the three lines that we are going to be having something like this? So the lines can be in any way, any format or any way, it follows the same principle. So how can we draw a circle in such a way that it will touch the three lines? You know, this is a freehand sketch, so the circle is not looking like a circle. So that's what we are going to be doing in this video. So first, let's just draw three lines. So let's, so let's take this as the first line. So let me call this line A line a b so let's draw the second line so let's call it this point c so line a c and then from point b so let's also draw another line and let's call this d line b d so how can we draw you know a circle A circle inside these three lines that like you touch the three lines one two three so now that we have the three lines the next thing is to we are going to bisect these two angles this angle here this angle here we are going to be bisecting it so that we can get the center of the circle that we are going to be drawing so to do that you just pick your compass at any convenient uh, length of the compass so let's start from point b now so from point b you draw an arc to cut the two lines the two lines so then I'll just inc uh, increase the length again to a convenient length so from where the arc is touching line BD so you draw another arc with the same length you go to this other point on line AB now you draw another arc so where the two arc meets, you draw a line straight down to point B. To so point B. Now we've been able to bisect this angle B. Now what we've done to this uh, angle B, we are also going to do the same thing to that of A. So you pick your compass. You now let me reduce it again at a convenient length. You draw an arc that is from point A now. So for point A, draw an arc. So let me just, the reason why I'm increasing it, I'm not using the same length, is that if I do not increase it, um, I just need to increase it to, to a convenient length, like I said, so that the arc can be far a bit. So let me just increase it a bit. So from this point, so from this point, you draw an arc. Don't forget what we are doing here now is bisecting the angles. So you draw the arc with the same length. You go to the second point. You draw the second arc. So where they meet, so where the two arcs meet, you draw a straight line to point A. Point A. Now, these two straight lines, the meeting points, they are meeting at this point. So this point now is the center of the circle that we are going to draw that will touch the three lines. So what we can do is we can just decide to draw a straight line down, down to point A, B. So that will be the, uh, the radius of the circle. So I can just pick my compass, you know. So now to get the length, you can as well use your ruler to measure it. Then you take your pick your compass to get the length on your ruler, whichever way. So with that, now we can now draw the circle.
So with that, we've been able to draw the circle to touch three points. At this line here, my compass left the center, so that's why we're having another line here. So always be careful when you are drawing your circle, especially when the circle is very big. You know, that's when this mistake used to happen. So, so this is it, guys. If you find this video helpful, kindly click on the subscribe button, and then I'll see you all in another video. Thank you.